Lisa Welshell. Come in, Lisa. We'll come back after this word from the local station. Boy, it just keeps getting renewed. I know, I know. But prior to your success on uh, Facts of Life, though, you were on other shows. Yes, nothing you know, that I could. That nobody would remember me from except maybe a few of the younger people. I was on the new Mickey Mouse Club. M I C K E. <laughs> oh, you're on the new one. The new one. Well, that did the pretty well. That went, a, that went about a year or two. About a year and a half. Mm -hmm. What'd you do on that? Oh, we sang, we danced, and we did little skits and introduced cartoons. Did you have a special talent, I mean, that you did? Uh... Well, we all did pretty much the same thing. I, I guess the special talent was even, you know, getting in the audition, and so I figured I needed something unique. Where they auditioned uh, so many kids, and... Um, What'd you do? I did ventriloquism, and, you know... Were you a ventriloquist? I had done a, a little of it, and then I perfected it, and uh, auditioned with ventriloquism. Let me see you do it. Oh, well, I, I usually have a puppet. I, I need. Do you it. move your lips? Oh, I hope not. <laughs> I'll be a puppet. Well, I well, I actually, it's, I guess it's even better because they're referred to as dummies. So. Uh, <laughs> I'm on the Grammy voting oh, committee. No. <laughs> okay. Um, so I'm not gonna sit on your lap. I'll break your legs. Tell you what, when oh. I I usually have a string, so I'll just pull your hair, and Ooh, you careful. can open your mouth. Okay. okay. There, how you doing? My name is Nerd the Griffin. That's good. <laughs> you don't say. <laughs> I didn't know how to do this. No, that was very good. I'm Look, talking about when you did it. A little southern accent in there, though, Lisa. Oh no, it shows. Just every so often, I hear a little. It's not supposed to. It, at least it doesn't on Blair, I hope. No. But uh, where's I'm that from? From Fort Worth, Texas. We oh, Fort Worth. Good. Yeah, but uh, when I get on the show, for some reason, when I get into the character, uh, my voice lowers and get ri gets rid of the accent. But when you're Lisa, it just goes right it out. Pops <laughs> what are your career goals? Like anybody else, I would like to be able to live anywhere other than L.A. and be and be able to do that. Like just, everybody. Well, else. well, you know what I mean. Most <laughs> of the people around L.A. Yeah. Um, well, not I guess most people I know. But in the people in the entertainment business, I mean, Hollywood now is everywhere. That's it's true. not just this town anymore. That's Gee. true, that's true. There are some people who don't even ever come here and are big Hollywood movie stars. That's true. And they live well, in, like uh, Jim Neighbors living in Hawaii. That's the thing uh, I'd like Robert to do. Redford I'd like living to live somewhere else and Colorado. be able to do just yeah. one movie a year, preferably a comedy, and then spend the rest of the time raising my family. And Where have you seen that you really like between Fort Worth and Hollywood? Boy, Fort Worth sure is close to my heart. But it's not Fort Worth. Oh, you Worth. want to go back home? Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. I've been trying to transplant my family out here, but they don't got a big come? old gang back there. And it's hard. <laughs> How big an old gang? Gosh, I have uh, one real brother, two half-brothers, a step-brother, and, and two nine step fake brothers. <laughs> <laughs> and they all live in one house except one half-brother. Oh, well, sure you miss them. That's oh, great, yeah. a big family like that. Well, we're all going to tune in the Grammys and watch you go up there and hope you get that big prize. Thank you very That's much. That's very good getting a nomination, and it's a lovely album and a great cover there, Lisa.